What is going on guys? I'm Jehovah and I have some more Halo 5 rec packs to open. Alright? Hopefully we don't get wrecked. Haha. -ha. Anyways guys, I have, looks like, uh, I think I have three gold packs. Yeah, three gold packs and these Warzone packs. I, I So the digital um, edition of the game that I got comes with 14... Uh, Warzone Premium Packs, and I've learned that the way that those come is twice a week for seven weeks. Uh, so I happen to have four of those stacked up right now, as it's been a while since I've opened them. And then all these other ones I've acquired through gameplay, and uh, as you can see I even have some rec points. But I think I'm going to save those for now because I have enough to open, so we're just going to roll with it. Uh, but yeah, so three gold packs, four Warzone Premium Packs, uh, shit, promotional rec pack couple promotion awards what was that one commendation reward battle rifle pack commendation reward commendation reward commendation reward so let's start with this shit one over here the promotional rec pack i know there's going to be some legendary shit in this lol wow i um i called it i did not expect that at all the Halo Channel Legendary Emblem. <laughs> wow. Alright, well that's pretty good fucking luck. On the first one we opened, we got a Legendary, so that's pretty sick. And a random weapon spawn, uh, uncommon and common, so that's cool. Good shit. Now let's do these other uh, bronze ones, I guess you would call that bronze. It looks bronze to me, right? Promotion Award. Let's go ahead and open this. Can, can, we, can, we, can we get... See, it only says a selection of wrecks to use on the battlefield. I didn't even look at the description of the other one. I was pretty much not at all expecting a legendary. I don't even know if it's possible to get it out of this. I didn't know it was possible to get it out of the last one, to be honest. Here we go! Oh no, no legendary! Corp warthogs, saws, needlers, uh, and a lot of- <laughs> I saw some comments that were like, Dude, saws are sick, quit bitching! The saw is powerful as fuck, but I don't really care about any, um, I don't care about any of the, like, needlers and warthogs, what do you call, um, you know, the, uh, the fucking warzone, goddamn stuff. I don't, I don't, I don't enjoy warzone as much as I do arena, so, yeah, I just want beautiful gun skins and armor visors helmets that's the shit i'm looking for so all right here we go another promotion award let's see what we get a bunch of saws i'm guessing yep speed boost corp warthogs blah 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 um also the people that question the order in which i open these i just like to save the best for last nothing else really matters to me so all right we are down to the Commendation Reward Packs, and we're going to save that Battle Rifle Pack till after the regular Commendation Rewards. Then we'll go to the Golds, and then we'll go to the Warzone Premiums. So let's go ahead and see what's in this first Commendation Reward Pack here. I have to sneeze. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm leaving that in the video because it's real life. I love you guys. Alright, here we go. Ew, a whole bunch more stuff to sell. Uh, I think that's pretty much all you can get from these. Like I said, though, I didn't expect to get an emblem, especially... <clears throat> now my nose is stuffed up. I especially didn't expect to get um, a, a goddamn legendary emblem from that one, so... Uh, but yeah, alright, so, bunch of shit probably end up selling all that stuff down to rec points because like I said I don't play that game mode very often uh, it, it's fun but it's not my cup of tea I prefer arena so all right let's go right into accommodation reward pack numero dos here we go come on you suck it's all I think I think that's all these are yeah just just a bunch of stupid shit just uh but look so we got 100 200 wait no well 225 Alright, yeah, so we, we got like 350 points or some shit from that. So, you know, I mean, I, I guess I can at least look at it like that. That's like a bonus rec points package. Because I'm just going to sell all the shit in there more than likely. Alright, here we go. 
More shit to sell, yay. Actually, I'll probably keep stuff like the fuel rod cannons, so when I do play, um, you know, I can just spawn in OP shit the entire time, but all the... Uh, well, I don't know. I might keep some saws. Needlers are pretty OP in this game, too. I don't know, man. I'm so torn. I'm so torn. Okay. One more accommodation reward pack here. And then we've got the battle rifle pack, which I don't know exactly what that means. More saws, more needlers. Lame, 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 lame. Um, let's see. Your achievement on the field of battle will not go unrewarded. Now, does that... I wonder... I mean, if it's a battle rifle pack, that would make me think that... Um, hopefully, being, you know, hopeful, I would hope that that's a battle rifle skin, but it could just mean that you get battle rifles, uh, like wreck battle rifles. Uh, like, damn, what am I trying to say? Warzone battle rifles, like spawn in, you know what I'm saying. Uh, I don't know, let's find out together. The battle rifle pack, come on, please, please, please be something cool. Skins, ooh. Ooh, Panda BR. Rare. I like that. That's a, that's a pretty unique emblem. I just like emblems that I haven't seen anybody else using for the most part. I don't I don't think I've seen that one yet. So, and then we got saws and needlers. <laughs> and a couple more fuel rod canoons. So that's cool. But now we're down to the meat and gravy. The meat and potatoes. The creme de la creme, whatever that means. We're down to the Warzone premiums. And the gold packs. We've got three gold packs. Let's start with the one over here because it's out of place and it bothers me. So if you don't know and you haven't watched uh, any of these rec pack openings yet, um, as you can see, the description says gold rec, rec blah, blah, gold rec packs contain a large amount of uncommon two legendary recs. Two recs will be permanent unlocks if available. All right, so let's do this. Let's go ahead and open it. See what we get. Ooh, Mako. Ooh, we got a new stance. I'm pretty sure that's the first stance that I've gotten. Um, so that's pretty cool. Points of light in an infinite darkness. Let's go ahead and equip that. <laughs> and Mako. Mako looks pretty, pretty cool. I have a legendary um, armor on right now, but I, but I like that one. That one's nice. Uh, and then ghosts. I love. I, if I'm gonna get anything for that game type, I love to go. I love to spawn ghosts in. Uh, for sure. Ooh, the sword ghost. Hey, Arbiter's contacts and influence give him the ability to acquire a new ghost manufactured with the latest nano nano laminate blends. Upgraded ghosts with thicker armor so they last longer. Cool beans. Warzone RP boost. Nice. I love the uh, the XP boost. The RP boost. Those are always good to have. So. Um, so as you can see here, now my guy is in a different stance. So the stance is something kind of cool because it's something you look at uh, quite often, and it's just kind of cool to have something different than the uh, the default. So that's cool. All right, first gold pack, not bad, not bad. Let's get into the second one here. Let's see what we have. Oh my Atlanta! Oh, look at that! Look at that! Look at that visor! And the light rifle, that's pretty good. Light rifle certification, uh, these are worth 100 a pop. So even if I'm not using them, um, you know, I'll get a lot now and I can sell them bitches like hotcakes. So that's cool. Plus the light rifle is pretty OP. Um, the Regnum, Regnum Mofo Visor, cool. Some more Ghost, um, Beam Rifle, Sword Ghost, Random Vehicle, and Gambit Spartan Kills. Rank in the top 50% for Spartan kills and claim your XP. All right. So that's cool. Let's go ahead and let's, well, let's just remember the name Regnum. Let's see what we have now. So now we have like a dark blackish one. Let's go to Spartan appearance, uh, visor. Is this Regnum? Yep, it is. So Sunspot, that's what I was like. At first I was like, damn, I already have that one. Regnum's close, but in the previews, they look like identical, but if you look at my helmet, uh, that's a much brighter red, and the blue is brighter too. This one's like a darker purple with a little pink, and that turns reddish blue. I like that. Right now, I've got this like silvery one on. The gold is pretty cool, but it's just hard to see. The, the, uh, the preview looks better. We'll put that one on for now, just because it's new. I like to throw on stuff that's new. All right. Our last gold, and then we're going to get in to the Warzone premiums, which should be the good stuff. Here we go. Oh, we got something good. Oh, it's so pretty. Sniper rifle certification is sick. 
Um, obviously sniper rifles are something that you'd be interested in spawning in. And looky here, ladies and gentlemen. Now, I think like the AR and the pistol skins are the best to get because those are the default weapons in the majority of the game types, so that's what people are going to see the most. Um, but if you're playing, oh god, I can't think of the name of, oh, what's it called? Uh, the damn, the game type that is uh, pretty much search and destroy. I, I, for whatever reason, I cannot think of the name of it right now, but I really do enjoy that game type, and I believe that the spawn-in weapon for that is an SMG. Uh, so that is cool. I'm glad I have that. We'll go ahead and equip that. That's my first, I believe that's my first SMG skin. So that is sick. That is good. And overshield twos. I didn't even notice those were twos. Extra layer of shields that do not regenerate. Extra layers displayed in green. Wired, wired, wired. Cool. Ooh, a scorpion. Hey. A random vehicle. Ultra rare. Oh, shit. To use or to sell for 200 rec points. Hmm. An arena XP boost. Nice. Good, good, good. Good. Pretty good. Good last. Good final gold to end on there, right before our Warzone premiums. Here we go. Oh my Lanta. Let's do this. How many legendaries do you guys think we're going to pull out of these? So, here, I'll read the description for you guys. Like I said, if you're new to rec packs, you don't really understand what's going on, I'll try to be a little more informational for you guys. So, premium rec packs contain three permanent unlocks, if available and carry an array of uncommon to legendary wrecks. So here we go, let's get into these. I should be getting two of these every week, like I said with the, um, I don't remember what the, it's some sort of a wreck pack uh, like bundle thing that you can buy. I think they're on Amazon now, you can get them for like 25 bucks, you get 14 of these, uh, two every week for seven weeks. Here we go, first one. Oh, please. Oh, what's that? SMG Uncommon. SMG with the CQB sight and stabilization jets. What? Stabilization jets? Rapid fire submachine gun. Best suited for close quarters combat. What? Oh, there's so much good stuff to look at right now. While leveraging smart link stabilization jets help you control recoil. We are definitely going to have to try that. That sounds crazy. It's like a new and improved SMG. But I don't know if we use that. Does it still allow our weapon skin? to be applied because it's technically not the same SMG. I don't know how that works. I hope that it still allows the use of your new weapon skin. Assault rifle, uh, what is this? With a projection sight and energy bayonet? Energy bayonet, standard issue, fully automatic rifle, effective to short to medium range. E energy bayonet increases melee damage and range. Wow, that's awesome too. All right. We got some rare armor here. Goblin Dakabi. Dakabi. The sensor warping technology technology that goblin prototypes were rumored to be fitted with did not appear in production models. Cool. I kind of like the uh, like the waves of, of the lighter color, the secondary color on that. Looks nice, like on the shoulder. QQ and some light rivers, light rifles, blah, blah, blah. Random randoms. Cool. All right. Well... Definitely going to have to check out that SMG. That's interesting. And three more Warzone premiums. Here we go. Let's get into it. Oh my, look at all those Wraiths. So we got, looks like, certification heavy pack here. We got Wraith certification. So we have quite a few Wraiths. And then we got Whiplash, which is a security clearance upgraded. Your Spartan is authorized to receive more of the... Oh, duh, I'm reading the wrong one. Oh, gosh, look at that. There's the new helmet over there. That's distracting. Uh, Acheron, Acheron, Acheron Security has recently made <coughs> great strides in developing compact, fast discharge energy cells and miniaturized sensors, improving railgun, featuring a faster charge cycle, multiple shots per magazine, and projectiles fitted with proximity airburst fuse. Interesting. That's a pretty, pretty good, um, what would you call it? Pretty good, uh, power weapon soldier dog face that's i'm it's hard because i like the ones like that that helmet is unique i like the style the shape of it and everything um but it's hard to get behind a good helmet that doesn't have much visor because the visor just looks really cool with all the custom visor colors but uh but that's pretty cool that is we'll have maybe we'll try that out uh scorpion whiplash scorpion Random vehicles and arena XP boosts. Sick. I like me some arena XP boosts. 
Here we go, two more Warzone Premiums. Let's see what we get in our second to last. Can we get a Legendary? One more Legendary pull. Oh, something good. Oh, my Lanta. Battle Rifle. Battle Rifle with Recon Sight and Energy Bayonet. So we got two, we got the, the Assault Rifle with Energy Bayonet and the Battle Rifle now. Cool. Increases melee damage and range. Commando Verde. This reminds me of, was it, I want to say CQB, but that might be wrong. I think it was a CQB helmet that I used in Halo 3, and it reminds me of that. I may be, I may be completely off on the name, uh, but, I, but there was a helmet in Halo 3 that I used that looked kind of similar to this. The visor's a little bit different, and there, there's not like, it looks like, looks like there's a Keurig coffee maker on his forehead, which is interesting. Um, but yeah, and then I like this. So that's what I was just saying. Like, the, it's kind of silly looking, but with all that visor space, like if you get a sick visor and you put it on this helmet, it's gonna look crazy. So we'll put that on just to play with visors. Um, like if you get it, like I said, if you get a really sick visor with a really bright color, that's like the first thing that people notice. They're like, holy shit. Um, so that's cool. Scorpions, beam rifles, wraiths, and a Warzone. Ooh, legendary, legendary Warzone XP, XP boost. I can't even read XP right now, that's how drunk I am. So that's pretty cool. I don't know if I've... Have I had a Legendary Warzone XP boost? I don't know. Alright guys, here we go. Last... Oh, wait a minute, look at that. See, that's what I'm talking about. Look at that visor. Like, that is so fucking pretty. Let's just, real quick, we got to, before the last one. We just have to. Visors, let's just scroll through them here and look at... See, even the gold looks so much better because you actually get a chance to see it. Um... Sunspot, that is like a bright ass purple. That is sick, nasty, blue. Dude, that's I really like that. We're gonna we're gonna leave the regnum on this new helmet. That looks pretty cool. I like that. We'll leave that for now. Alright. Open packs. Last pack here, guys. Warzone premium pack. I need everybody to cross their fingers and their testicles right now because we're gonna get something sick. I can feel it. Come on! Oh no, nothing nothing good, I don't think. It didn't make a cool little... All right, Reflex Enhancers Rare Emblem increased... Oh wait, that's not an emblem. It, it's kind of in the shape of an emblem. I'm retarded. Increased weapon handling speed and you can reload while sprinting. Cool. Oh, we finally got the long shot AR. I've seen a lot of people with this. Um, so the long shot AR is a, as an AR, but it has a scope on it. So with a long shot sight, UNSC Marine Corps inter interim fire team support IFS configuration for intermediate range combat and long range suppression. And then we got the interceptor imperator, 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 blah, blah, blah. uh, armor, beam rifle, scorpion, blah, blah, blah and two random weapons so that is it we're out of rec packs now if you guys are enjoying these i really enjoy doing them um i i like opening packs in halo it's 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 cool it's it's a they, you know what i really do feel like they did um the packs and everything the right way like they really did so um if you guys want to see more i would definitely like to show more just uh you know let me know let me know and i will I will show you more, okay? I promise I will. I promise, I promise. I love you guys. Thanks for watching, and I will catch you guys next time. Also, let me know if you guys are interested in seeing like a collection video where I could just go through, um, play with all my helmets and armors, and show you guys what I have as of right now, all my weapon skins, all that good stuff. So, uh, yeah, love you guys. See you next time.